Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Hi, guys. Hello, Sandra Carolina. Hello, teacher. How are you today? I'm fine. And you, teacher? I am okay also. Thank you so much for asking. Excellent. Let's see who else. Sulema. Hi. Hello. Hi. How are you today? Fine. Thank you. And you? Fine. I'm okay also. Thank you so much. Like the blue Thanks ball. for Great. being here. Let's see who else is here. I have... Hi, Gavi. Hello, Gavi. Hi. Good night, teacher. Hello. Good evening. How are you today? Fine. Excellent. Nice to have you here. Let's see. Here we have Adrian. Hi. Hi How are you today? ¿Cómo se dice mal y cansado? Ah, you will be bad and tired. Bad. Se lo voy a escribir. Bad okay. and tired. Okay. Bad and tired. Bad and tired. So, so sad to hear that. Okay. Let's see who else is here. Angel Antonio. Angel Antonio. Hello. How are you today? Like the red rat. I'm okay. You are okay. Excellent. Nice to have you like here. Blue frog. Let's see. I want to see your cameras, guy. Please. Your cameras. Only Sulema, Sanda, Gabriela, and Adrian. What's going on? ¿Por qué los demás no la tienen encendida? Why, why, why? I want to know. Okay, but thank you, Nancy. Thank you, Rosaelba. Hi. Hello. How are you today? I'm fine. Excellent. Good. Nice to see your face. Here we have Alexandra. Hi. Hi, Alexandra. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Fine. Thank you. Excellent. Hello. Nice to see your face. I'm okay also. Thank you. Nice to see your beautiful faces. Nancy, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. How are you today? Uh, good. good. <laughs> okay, nice. Hello, Adriana. How do you feel? Good evening, teacher. I feel good. Excellent. You sound better. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> Excellent. Let's see, Pamela. Hello. Pamela is not here. Okay. So, Karen Selina, hello. How are you today? Hi, I'm um, a little bit tired. What about you? I'm a little bit tired too. Yes, I want to sleep right now. <laughs> yes, just... me too. <laughs> exactly. Okay, but we are ready to start with the class, right? Excellent. Hoy no va a poder hablar. Okay, Pamela, there's no problem. Okay, probably tomorrow you can talk and I can see your face. Okay, so let's begin with the class, guys. Let's begin. Empecemos con la clase. Let me just share my screen. Let me see who else is here. Few people, poca gente, right? Few people, only 12. Okay, but we are going to begin with that people. There's no problem about it. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate it, okay? So let's begin, as you could see. Hello, good afternoon, guys. We are going to begin with today's class and look at it. I have a question for you. Oh, but, antes de que empecemos con la clase, look at it. Remember, esta semana sería sección número four, okay? Número cuatro. Para esta semana sería esta sección. Recuerden que tienen que tenerlo hecho antes del día jueves a la medianoche. ¿Ok? Como recordatorio. Si van eh, clase por clase, sería mucho mejor. Clase vista, tarea hecha. Y así llega el jueves, solo tienen una actividad que hacer. ¿Ok? Excellent. So let's begin. Look at it. I have this question for you that it's, what do you know about clothes? ¿Qué saben acerca de ropa? ¿Tienen ustedes vocabulario de ropa? ¿Or not? ¿Do you have any vocabulary about clothes? ¿Or not? So, a little bit. A little bit, ok. 
So let's begin. ¿Quién me puede dar vocabulary about clothes? Los que sepan, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Who wants to start? Sweaters. Jeans. Ok, I, I heard a lot. I heard jeans. Sweater, if I'm not wrong. Shoes, I think. What else? ¿Qué más? What else? Here. Sorry, I couldn't hear. Shirt. Shirt, exactly. What else? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Dress. Dress, exactly. I was trying to guess exactly. Dress, what else? Angel, do you know any vocabulary about it? Angel. And he is not here. Okay, there's no problem. No. Yes. Hello. No, no vocabulary. No. No. Okay, there's no problem. So pay attention, okay? Let's see, Nancy. Do you know vocabulary? Uh, teacher. Okay. Hold on, Gabby. Yes, Nancy? <laughs> no, you don't know. Ya, ya estaba, camisa iba a ah, sure, shirt. okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Let's see, Gabby. Um, top and short. Top, you said? Top? Short. Short. Mm -hmm. Shorts, exactly. We have shorts. And later, um, top, the gorra, cap. Cap, exactly. Gorra. We also have gorra. What else, guys? ¿Qué más, chicos? Only that vocabulary? Socks. Socks, exactly. We have socks. A skirt. Skirt, excellent. What else? ¿Qué más? Sweet. Okay, sorry, Adriana. Sweet. Sweet. Eh, traje, no me acuerdo. Ah, es yeah, yeah, yeah. Suit. A suit, suit. Excellent. Yes. Suit. Yes. It, because if we say sweet, we are talking about dulces, right? Dulce. Yeah. So that is the difference between the two of them. One is suit. Yeah. The other one is sweet. Yeah. yeah. Tenis. Es lo mismo. Tenis. Eh. Aha. In this case, we have to say sneaker. Sneakers. Así se dice tenis, ¿ok? Sneakers. Uh -huh. <laughs> exactly, sneakers. Look at the pronunciation. Decimos sneakers. No decimos sneakers. No. Tenemos que ir de un solo con el s. Sería sneakers, ¿ok? That will be in that way. What else? What more? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Ajá, uh -huh. only that vocabulary. It was a scarf. Scarf, exactly. ¿Alguien sabe qué significa scarf? This is the first time. Calcetines, creo. Ajá, calcetines is socks. Bufanda. Okay. Scarf is bufanda, exactly. That is a scarf. What else? ¿Qué más, guys? Only that? Uh, yeah. On the table. Table? Table? Uh huh. Table is about clothes. Table? No, right? Table is mesa, okay? And now we are talking about clothes, okay? Ropa. Okay? Clothes. But thank you so much. Okay, Rocio, there's no problem. Thanks for telling me. Let's see. Brenda Guadalupe, hello. Brenda Guadalupe. No, Brenda Guadalupe. Okay. Raquel Abigail, hello. Can you tell me one word? ¿Puede darme una palabra con respecto a clothes? Eh, voy ingresando a la clase, teacher. Tenía problemas con el inter. Okay. Sobre cual, cualquier este palabra. Sí, estamos hablando con respecto a ropa. Ok. Um, suero, ya está. 
sweater. Uh -huh. yes. Sweater, yes. what else? Do you know any other one? Only sweater? Sí. Only that. Okay, no hay problema, okay? okay? Don't worry. Don't worry. Sí, decir, guantes, gloves, creo que es... Ajá, guantes serían gloves. Gloves, exactly. Good. Yes, Ángel? Jacket. Jacket, excellent. We have also jacket. Like jacket. What else? ¿Qué más, qué más? Blusa. Stockings. Ok, hold on. Blusa, blusa, lo decimos. Blows. Ok. Dígame, no Karen. Lo mismo que es, es skirt. Mm -hmm. Blusa. Si no es lo mismo que shirt. Uh -huh. No, blusa. Bueno, well, this case, blows es blusa. Y shirt sería camisa. Ok. Ok, that will be the difference. Yes, tell me. Sorry, Karen. Stockings. Stockings? Can you type I... it in the chat, please? Ok. Excellent. Thank you so much. Aha, uh -huh. what else? Only that, guys? Yes, yes, no, no. Yes, only that. Ok, so there's no problem about it because today, stockings. Ah, stockings. Ok, but this will be like calcetas largas, right? Exactly. Calcetines? Yes. Medias. Uh -huh. Yes. Medias lo decimos in another way, ok? But, yeah. Ok. Excellent. Ya les voy a enseñar cómo se dice porque está en el video. Y está en vocabulary extra, ok? Thank you so much, yeah. Karen. Good. So look at it, guys. Tenemos este vocabulario que sabemos. Vamos a repasarlo ahorita. Les voy a dar la pronunciation. Ok. Pants. Teacher, pants. Pants. Exactly. We were missing pants. Excellent. Pants. Gorro. Gorro. How do you say gorro? Do you know? ¿Cómo decimos gorro? Nadie se acuerda. Hat. We can say it hot, exactly. We can say it hot, gorro. Excellent. Y okay. existirá, teacher, camisa manga larga. It can be, it can be shirt, okay? It can Solo be shirt. Así. Yes, it can be like that. It has another name, but the most common one, el más común es shirt. Okay? Okay. Excellent. So let's begin with this. I want you to repeat after me. Look at the first one. Jeans. 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 Ah, here we have sweater. 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 We have shoe. Shoe. We have shirt. Shirt. Then we have dress. Dress. And shorts. Shorts. Then we have cup. Cup. Socks. Socks. We have cured. 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 Exactly. cured. This one, suit. 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 Excellent. Sneakers. Sneakers. Sneaker. Scarf. Scarf. One more time. Scarf. Scarf. Excellent. Good pronunciation. Then we have gloves. 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 Jacket. Jacket. Blows. Blows. Stockings. Stockings. Pants. Pants. And hat. 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 Excellent. Good. Excellent. Good job. So now look at it. Ah, something that I was forgetting to tell you. Recuerden, chicos, que clothes, esta palabra, es en inglés, is not countable. No la podemos contar. En inglés, esta palabra no se puede contar. Entonces, ustedes no me pueden decir, I have a cloth. ¿Ok? Porque no se puede contar. Entonces, esta no la podemos ocupar. ¿Cómo podemos decir entonces? I have a piece of cloth. ¿Ok? I have a piece of cloth. 
have a piece of clothes. Nunca me vayan a decir, I have a clothes, porque no se puede, ¿ok? Clothes no es contable. That is the thing I want to tell you. Another thing that I want to tell you is this. En inglés, nunca ocupamos use con ropa. Ustedes no me pueden decir, I use a shirt. No. Eso está prohibido, ¿ok? In English, we say, I wear a shirt. ¿Ok? I wear a shirt. Lo mismo pasa con los zapatos. I wear, uh, for example, let me see. I wear sneakers, for example. I wear sneakers. ¿Ok? No me van a decir, I use sneakers. No. I wear. It will be wear. ¿Ok? Excellent. So let's begin with this. Here we have garment. ¿Alguien sabe qué significa garment? Prenda de vestir, ¿ok? Es parecido a esto. Es otra manera de llamar a teacher. piece of clothes. Yes. Disculpe, teacher. Y este, con ese ejemplo que usted puso, I use a shirt y I wear sneak sneakers. Este, ¿y cómo, en qué momento se usa el I use? Ah, it can be I use my cell phone, I use a notebook, I use a computer. Ah, cuando okay. es algo que no tenemos puesto, entonces. Exactly, exactly. Cuando es algo que tenemos puesto, como dijo Lisandro, ocupamos where. Ok. Excellent. Good question. I like it. Entonces, les decía que garment es un sinónimo de piece of cloth. ¿Ok? Un sinónimo de piece of cloth. Entonces, vamos a ver este video donde nos dan la pronunciación de los diferentes tipos de prendas que tenemos para vestir. Voy a poner el video. Pay attention. And later, I will give you the pronunciation. ¿Ok? So pay attention right now. I will play the video and I will mute my microphone. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn clothes vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work. And the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Clothes for work. Shirt. Tie. Tie. Belt. Belt. Jacket. Jacket. Pants. Pants. Suit. Coat. Sh shoes. Blouse. Blouse. Scarf. Blouse. Skirt. Skirt. High heels. <clears throat> High heels. Raincoat. 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 Dress. Dress. Clothes for leisure. Hat. Sweater. Jeans. Gloves. Gloves. Boots. Mira, cap. cap. T shirt. Shorts, socks, sneakers, pajamas, swimsuits. Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. All right, so there you go with the new, new vocabulary, okay? Here we have, as you could see, we divide it into two categories. We have clothes for work and clothes for leisure, ¿ok? ¿Alguien sabe qué significa esa palabra? Leisure. ¿Está de aquí? ¿Alguien sabe? Leisure. Camiseta. This one, leisure. Leisure significa como para cuando estamos en la casa, ¿ok? Descansando, ¿ok? When we want to rest. Leisure. Ropa para estar en casa, ¿ok? Leisure. Exactly. So let's begin with clothes for work. Here we have shirt. Repeat after me. Shirt. 
shirt. Tie. Tie. Si decimos corbata, okay? Tie. Then we have belt. 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 Jacket. 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 Pants. Pants. We have suit. 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 Coat. 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 Shoes. 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 This one, raincoat. 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 Dress. 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 High heels. High, High heels. heels. High heels. Skirt. 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 Ajá, agregamos una S, ok, antes. Decimos skirt. 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 Okay. Scarf. Scarf. Clothes. Clothes. Excellent. Now let's see. We have hat. 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 We have sweater. Sweater. Jeans. 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 Gloves. 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 Boots. 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 Sneakers. Cards. Socks. Socks. Shorts. Shorts. T-shirt. T-shirt. Cap. Y aquí tenemos pajamas. 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 Y estos son swimsuit. Swim suit. Swim suit. Swim suit. Aha. Any question about vocabulary? About I have a question, teacher. Yes, tell me. For the pajamas, we can also say uh, jammies. Yes, it could be, but it is like oh. a more like informal. It is like a street English. Oh, okay. Okay. Good question. Thank you. Next. You're welcome. Okay. So there you go. We say it pajamas, okay? Pajamas. Pajamas. Excellent. It is. It was not for you, Karen. Okay. It was not for you. Your pronunciation. Okay. Was good. <laughs> okay. But yes, we say pajamas. Who wears pajamas a... here? Adrián, do you wear pajamas? Or not? Not. No. Okay. What about you, Sandra? Do you wear pajamas? No. No. And you, Adriana? No. No. Jennifer, probably? No. 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 Okay, let's see. Gabby, do you wear pajamas? No, teacher. No. Okay, no. Ari Sulema, do you wear pajamas? Yes, I wear. Yes. I like it. Excellent. I like it. Thank you. Let's mm -hmm. see, Nancy. Do you wear pajamas? Yes, teacher. Yes, good. And Angel, do you wear pajamas? No, no, teacher. No, okay. Raquel, do you wear? No. No. No, okay. What about you, Lisandro? Do you wear pajamas? No. No, no, no. I okay. Work. Excellent. So look at it. Here you have vocabulary about uh, clothes for work and for leisure. Okay. Alguna pregunta con respecto a la pronunciación? I'd like for you to talk. Guys? No. Los tacones altos, teacher. High. Ah, high. Like this one. We say high heels. 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 Gracias. ¿Se dan cuenta? Aquí tenemos entre paréntesis este high. ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Podemos decirlo o podemos omitirlo, ¿ok? Si solo quieren decir I wear heels, is correct. Y si quieren decir I wear high heels, is also correct, ¿ok? So the two ways are totally acceptable. Ok, good. Now let's see. Here we have more vocabulary. Yes, Alexandra. Um, ¿Ya? Yeah. Uh, 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 ¿Puede retroceder la lámina, por favor? Yes, for sure. Yeah, tell me. Eh, 
I'm not okay. Mm -hmm. Bufanda, no lo logro ver bien. Ah, bufanda, ah, is scarf. Scarf. Se la voy a escribir en el chat. Is scarf. Scarf. Okay. Scarf. Exactly in that okay. way. Excellent. Any other question, guys, about it? No? No. Okay, thank you so much. So we are going to continue, and I'm going to give you more vocabulary about clothes, okay? So pay attention, because later we have an activity about it. Look at it. Let's begin. These ones, you already know them, right? We have suit, skirts, and tie. Tie is corbata. One more time I say it, okay? Tie is corbata. Look at it. Here we have a new one. We have tank top. For girls, right? They can use tank tops. Right? Look at it. Here we have this image about the tank top. Let's see. Here we have unisex clothes. We have the coat, the jacket the t-shirt, for example, and we also have trousers. Estos son pantalones, pero son pantalones formales, okay? So we say trousers, trousers. Los pantalones formales no ocupan con traje, por ejemplo, uh, for example, with the suit, right? With a suit, we wear trousers. Then we have jeans and shorts. Ahora, dijimos que sweater significaba suéter, pero tenemos diferentes tipos de suéter, right? In English, we have different type of sweaters. Look at the first one. In Spanish, we say suéter de meter, right? In English, we say jumper pullover, okay? Jumper pullover. This is the, the pronunciation, suéter de meter. And then we have these ones with these little bottoms. They are cardigans, okay? Look at the picture. Here we have a cardigan. And this one is, is well known, es más conocido como hoodie, like this. Oh my God, only hoodie, okay? Hoodie. Let's continue with more vocabulary because here we have more. Clothes for baby. We have the romper suit. Romper suit. And we have nappy. Okay, nappy. Sería como diaper, right? Nappy. And then we have for when you go to the beach, right? When you go to the beach, you can wear for men's a, for men, sorry, swimming trunk. Swimming trunk, calzoneta, right? Swimming trunk. And for girls, we have two different types. We have bikini, that is two pieces, bikini, or only one piece that can be swimsuit. Okay, we have different names. It can be swimsuit, it can be swimming costume, or it can be bathing costume. Pero el más común es swimsuit. This is the most common one. Swimsuit. Swimsuit. Now, look at it. Here we have more vocabulary for sleeping, right? We have night dress. This is camisón. Okay? Night dress. And then you put it all together, it's going to be nightdress. Nightdress. Then we have pajamas. Pajamas. Y este que lo ocupan más que todo en las novelas, right? O en las películas. Cuando alguien viene and they are wearing pajamas, they use dressing gown. Okay? Dressing gown. That is the way you say it. Dressing gown. Now, we have the underwear. The meaning of underwear means crop interior, okay? Underwear. For men, we have boxer. And we also have white 
fronts. White fronts. Calzoncillos, right? White fronts. The other one that we have for girls, it can be bra. It could be pant. But most of the time, people say panty. Okay? Look at it. We have stocking. Y lo que me decía Karen. Karen. I think it was Karen. Medias. Decimos tight. Okay? For girls. It can be also for boys sometimes. We say tight. Tight. That is the way you say it. And another thing. Unisex. Unisex. It will be best. Okay? Best. Centro. Okay? Vest. And now we are going to talk about shoes. Shoes, as you could see, is like in general. Zapatos in general, right? We are not like giving an specific shoes, okay? So look at it. We have the general one, shoes. We have sandals, boots. Estas serían botas largas, okay? Botas para lluvia could be also. Wellington, Wellington, pantuflas, slippers, slippers, y calcetines, right? Socks, that is the way you say it, socks. Look at it, we have for the head. This is a beret, okay? A beret. Boina in Spanish. It is known as boina, I think. A bread. And look at this. We have two types of hat. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? La forma. Okay. As you could see, la forma es diferente. This is a bowler hat. Bowler hat. And this is a trilby. Okay. That is the difference. But if you want to say only hat... There's no problem, okay? Si quieren decirle solo hat, no hay problema, okay? There you go. Do you have any question about the new vocabulary and the pronunciation, guys? Or everything is clear as water? Hmm? No question. Yes, I have a question. So, so, teacher, I need more practice. More practice, okay. So, we are going to have a practice, okay. So, don't worry about it. Excellent. Later, we are going to have a practice, but we need more vocabulary, okay. More vocabulary, a what? A <laughs> Sorry, about what? About colors, okay. We are going to study today clothes and colors because they are together, okay? They are tied. So look at it. Here we have some colors. I think you all know these ones, right? Todos se los saben, these ones? Yes, right? You are bilingual, and that is why. Let's see, Andrea. Andrea. Sorry. Adriana, can you help me with the pronunciation, please? What? Yeah, the pronunciation of this. Okay. Red, mm -hmm. pink, orange, yellow, light green, green, dark green, light blue, blue, dark blue, and purple. Excellent. Good pronunciation. I like it a lot. That was awesome. Okay, look at it. Here we have some words. For example, this one, light. We added before the color. Okay, so that we can create a new color. Tenemos entonces light green, green, and dark green. In Spanish, it will be verde claro, verde, y verde oscuro. Okay, so we have the three of them. Light green, green, and dark green green. Then we have light blue, blue, dark blue, and purple, as Adriana said, okay? Now, let's move on into the neutral colors, los colores neutros, okay? We have neutral colors. For example, we have, wait, 
we have white, we have light gray, only gray, dark gray, beige. Este es uno que ocupamos bastante en español, right? We say it beige. Then we have light brown, brown, and dark brown also. And at the end, for sure, black. That is the favorite color of Adrian, right? Black. Excellent. So now, the practice that you are going to have, I want you to create sentences, okay? Three sentences about what? I want you to describe what you are wearing. Quiero que me digan qué están vistiendo, pero quiero que me lo describan súper bien. Ok, que yo me imagine como que si lo estoy viendo cuerpo completo, ok. For example, I will give you my example. I wear pink shirt, a pink shirt, sorry. A pink shirt. Ok, look at it. I wear a pink shirt and it says, I dream in French. Ok, I am describing my shirt. I wear a pink shirt. Then I wear black shorts. Look at it. Quiero que se fijen en esto. Aquí, en la segunda oración, ya no ocupé A. ¿Por qué? ¿Alguien sabe por qué ya no ocupé A en la segunda oración? Or don't you know? ¿Saben Porque por qué? Short is, is plural. Excellent, Adriana. That is the correct answer. Porque shorts es plural. Y este A lo ocupamos para singular. Porque yo no puedo decir, estoy visto un shorts negro, right? Porque shorts es plural. Lo mismo pasa con calcetines. Calcetines es plural. Entonces, we have to say, I wear a red, a red, oh my God, I wear red socks, for example. ¿Ok? ¿Se dan cuenta? No estoy ocupando el A. ¿Por qué? Porque es plural. ¿Ok? Another example to describe what I am wearing. And I wear black flip flops. ¿Ok? Look at it. I want you to create at least three sentences, ¿ok? Quiero que me describan todo lo que están vistiendo, ¿ok? O sea, no todo, pero sí, casi todo, ¿ok? Almost everything. For that, I want you to create at least three sentences and you are going to have only two minutes to create it. That is enough, ¿ok? So look at it. Time is running, so I start working. Only two minutes, ¿ok? To create al menos tres oraciones. Si quieren crear más, go ahead and do it. Ok? Only two minutes. Les queda 45 segundos, ¿ok? 45 seconds to finish.
20 seconds, guys. Uh, did you finish, Adriana? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Puedo dar de comer a mis perros. Okay, Karen. We are creating three sentences describing what you are wearing. Okay? Like the examples you can see in the screen. This one. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Let's see, Adriana. So you can start, please. Okay. And I wear a pink shirt. I wear a black jeans. And I wear a green flip-flops. Excellent. Good. I like it. But remember one thing. Jeans is plural singular. Plural. Exactly. So we have to say, I wear... I wear black jeans. Excellent. And what about the flip-flops? Is that plural or singular? Uh, plural. Plural. So we have to say? I wear green flip-flops. Excellent. Good job. Thank you so much, Adriana. Crisia. Hi, Crisia. Crisia. Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm okay. What about you? Teacher, I'm sorry for la hora. Don't worry, okay? There's no yeah. problem. Excellent. Excellent. Can you can you read it? Puede leerlas? Ah, sí. Per, permítame. Yes. Let me see. Wait a minute, please. Dice, I wear a yellow. I era yellow, pero se me fue ahí. Error de dedo. I wear, I wear a yellow dress. I wear black sandals. I wear a black belt. What is belt? Belt. Conté al final. Ah, okay, yes. Because belt is campana, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's belt. Pincho. Exactly. Yes, okay. I understand. Thank you so much. La segunda está bien, así es. O es a black sandal. No, because sandals is plural. No, 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 la primera es, está bien así, la del vestido. Yes, because you are saying dress, only one. Ah, uh, bye. Okay. okay, thank you so much. Now let's see, Sulema, can you please? Uh, I wear a blue and white blues. I wear blue jeans. I wear black sandals. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's see, let's see, Lisandro, can you please? Qué combinada, anda sin su lemita. Siempre. <laughs> exactly. Okay. I wear a blue t-shirt. Uh, I wear blue jeans. Exactly. Y solo eso ando puesto nada más, teacher. Okay. What about the 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 feet? No tiene nada en los pies. No nada nada. Ni chanclas. Nada. Okay okay yes. that's great. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's great. Okay let's see Gaby. I wear a t-shirt and I wear a yellow shirt. And I wear a sunglasses black. Mm -hmm. It will be black at the beginning, okay? It will be black I wear sunglasses. Exactly, in that way. Thank you so much. Let's see, Karen, can you please? And I am wearing a brown t-shirt. Also, I am wearing a red uh, pants. And also, I am wearing a, a dark gray sneakers. Excellent. I like it a lot. Good job. ¿Se fijan cómo hizo, lo hizo Karen? Karen lo hizo con presente continuo, ¿ok? I'm wearing. ¿Ok? This is something I want you to pay attention to it because this week we are going to study that. ¿Ok? Thank you so much. Let's see who else. Adrián, can you please? I wear a black shirt. I wear dark blue shirt. I wear green 
flip flops. Pero sí creo que. Excellent. I, yes. Flip flops. Yes, Raquel. Go ahead. Estaba Go. ensayando, teacher. <laughs> so, ¿quién iba? You, you go. Okay. Uh, I wear white shoes. I wear a tan. How would you say uh, top, creo? Top? Se... Yeah, it will be top. Um, top. Green. Uh -huh. It will be green top, okay? Green top. Mm hmm I am wearing green shorts. Excellent. Yes, in that way. Great. Thank you so much, Andrea. Let's see, Nancy. What do you have? I wear a blue shirt. I wear red pants. I wear, <laughs> I wear a black shirt. Excellent. Yeah, so you are wearing a pan, a pant, and a short? Shoes. <laughs> Shoes, okay. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's see, Jenny, please go ahead. Hello, teacher. Hello, Jenny. Um, I wear I wear brown flip flops. Uh-huh. I wear a wine blouse, uh, pero para decir blusa con rayas, no sé cómo es. It will be with strips. Oh, white. El qué? Como dijo. Rayas. Rayas dijo be... ella. It could be sí, a pero usted dijo un montón de cosas. <laughs> <laughs> It will be a white strip. White strip. Blows. Strip blows. I white white strip blows. Strip blows. Exactly in that way. Um I wear, I, I wear a light brown skirt. Excellent. Good. Thank you so much. Let's see who else can mask. Sandra, can you please? Yes. I wear a gray t-shirt. I wear black glasses. I wear blue jeans. I wear black shoes. Excellent. Thank you so much. Good pronunciation. Let's see who else can help me. We have a lot of people with the camera off. I don't know if they work or not. Let me see. We have Pamela, Rosa Elba. We have Angel, Alexandra, Brenda Guadalupe. Mm -hmm. So, Angel, can you please? Okay. Uh, I wear a white shirt. I wear gray shorts. I wear blue flip flops. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's let's see, Alexandra. Can you help me, please? No, Alexandra. Hello. I'm sorry. I'm sleeping. My baby. Um. I wear a pink shirt. I wear a light gray shirt and I wear a black shirt. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's see, Pamela. Can you please? Pamela is not here. Okay, so let's see. Rosa Elba. I wear light gray shirt I wear black suit I wear blue jeans yes. I wear a black bra excellent okay thank you so much let's see the last one Brenda Guadalupe can you please no Brenda Guadalupe okay there's no problem. So now we are going to move into the next activity. What is the next activity? This is going to be a conversation. The conversation is called, it's a disaster, okay? 
it's a disaster. I'm going to read the conversation. Pay attention because later you are going to be my volunteers, okay? Let's start. Great, her clothes are dry. Where's my new blouse? What color is it? It's white. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? No, it's not mine. Wait, it is mine. It's a disaster. Oh no, all our clothes are light blue. Here's the problem. It's these new blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Ah, uh, they're mine. Sorry. Okay, there you go. Okay, this is the thing. There you go with the pronunciation. But before starting, Pamela, I wear orange shirt. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's see. In this case, Pamela, tenemos que agregar una A. Okay, I wear an orange shirt. Y no olviden el punto al final de la oración. Okay. El punto al final de la oración es necesario, porque si no lo tenemos, la oración no está correcta, ¿ok? El otro, I wear a red short, ¿ok? There you go, Pamela. Thank you so much for participating. ¿Ok, chicos? ¿Preguntas con pronunciation or the meaning o el significado de las palabras? No questions. No. Okay, if there are no questions, let's start. Gabi, you are going to be my volunteer. Gabi, it's going to be my volunteer with, with Adrian. Okay? So let's start. Great. Our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? What color is? <clears throat> White. Uh, here's a light blue blues. Así es, ¿verdad? Sí. Light blue blues. Yeah, light blue blues. ¿Cómo así? Uh-huh. Is it yours? Is it yours? No, it is not mine. What it wait. Wait. It is my, it's a disaster. Oh no, all our clothes clo clo are light blue. Here's the problem, it's these new blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Oh, they are mine, sorry. Okay, yeah. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for being my volunteers. Now, let's see. One thing that I want you to remember is that English has an intonation and a rhythm, okay? Remember, if you are making a question, you are going to say, where is my new blows? Okay? Con el sonido de, ¿a dónde está? Okay? It is different if I say, it's white. Con seguridad, okay? So, we have to say, great, or clothes are dry. Okay, that is the way in which we say it. So please, thank you so much. The two of them were excellent. Thank you so much. Now let's see, Adrian, can you choose a person? And Gabi, can you choose another person, please? Escoger una persona. Please, 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 please. Let's see. Um, Adriana. Adriana. And Adrian, who is your person? Um, okay, Adriana and Lisandro. Thank you so much, guys. You are my volunteers. Yeah, you, if you want. Okay. Great. Our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? What color is it? It's white. Here's a light blue blouse. Is this yours? No, it's, it's not mine. Wait, it is mine. It's a disaster. Oh no, all those clothes are light blue. 
Here's the problem. It's this. Is these new blue jeans? Whose jeans are they? Oh, uh, they are mine. Sorry. Excellent. The two of you. Great. Great. Thank you so much. I like the pronunciation and the intonation you gave to it. Excellent. That was great. Now let's see another person. Who else? Lisandra and Adriana? Can you tell me the last people? Ahorita nos vamos a desquitar. Vaya. Nancy. Okay, Nancy. Y... And? Crisia. And Crisia. Okay, Nancy and Crisia. Go ahead, please. Nancy, you start. Empieza ya. Yes. Um, <laughs> great or close are are dry, dry. Where is, why not dry a uh, dry where is a new blue 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 what color is it it's why here's a light blue blouse it is yours no, it's not night. Why is night? May is a disaster. Oh no! Our old clothes are light blue. Here, the problem is the the yes. new blue jeans. How jeans are are they? Oh, they're mine. Sorry. Okay. Thank you so much, the two of you. Nancy and Chrysia, let's choose the last people. The last one. I promise this is going to be the last one. Uh -huh. Abigail. Abigail. And Chrysia, who? Uh, Sandra Gonzalez. Okay. It's going to be Sandra and Jenny. Go ahead, please. Okay. You will start, Jenny. Hello. Green or close are three are three where is navy blues? What color is it? Is why hers a light blue blouse. It is yours. George? No, no, it's not my why is my is this is disaster. This is Oh no, all our clothes are light blue. Here's the problem. Is this is this new blue jeans? What jeans are they? Oh, they're my, sorry. Excellent, thank you so much the two of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. So now you are going to have homework assignment for tomorrow. What will be the homework? This one, I want you to practice as much as you can. I want you to practice by yourself in front of the mirror, right? Quiero que practiquen el audio, en la conversación, el diálogo. Ustedes solitos, si tienen alguien con quien practicar, that would be great, okay? Va a ser mucho mejor, pero quiero que lo practiquen, okay? Si se dan cuenta aquí, en la sección 4, sigue cargando, pero es el segundo video que aparece. Ahí está el video, obviamente tiene el audio para que ustedes puedan repetirlo tantas veces como quieran, ¿ok? Pero quiero que lo practiquen, sería este, ¿se dan cuenta? Aquí está el segundo video, Color and Conversation, It's a Disaster. Entonces, ahí ustedes van a encontrar la pronunciación, quiero que lo practiquen a lot y que mañana me traigan su mejor inglés, ¿ok? Saquen su cajita con su mejor inglés. Y me la entreguen mañana, ¿ok? Así cuando yo los escuche, diga, son nativos, ¿ok? Ellos ya saben inglés. So I want you tomorrow to practice it a lot of times. Si tienen nativos preguntas del de... Tazumal, teacher. Yes? Nativos del Tazumal, teacher. No, Lisandro, <risa> native people, English, ¿ok? Entonces, si tienen preguntas y no les queda claro la pronunciación con el audio, 
Recuerden que tienen ahí, está el grupo de WhatsApp. Hacen la pregunta ahí y yo les mando el audio con la pronunciación, ¿ok? Pueden preguntar 80 mil veces y no hay problema, ¿ok? Entonces quiero que lo practiquen y mañana traigan su mejor inglés a la clase y nos dejen con la boca abierta a todos, ¿ok? Entonces, that will be the homework for tomorrow. I want you to practice, practice and practice. Quiero que duerman en inglés, hablen en inglés, hagan todo en inglés, ¿ok? Excellent, so that you can improve. Great. So, guys, that will be all for today. Hope to see you tomorrow. Have a good night and sweet dreams. Good night, teacher. Bye-bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye bye. 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 See you. See you tomorrow. Alexandra. No me puedo desconectar. Ah, okay. Pensé que tenía una pregunta, okay? Nos vemos mañana. Feliz noche. Bye. Buenas noches.